Okay, well, this is certainly worth a, ch uh, a check to the ship's log. Let me see. What does that say here? Okay, so I'm finally through with this place, thank goodness. The Nomai fired the sun station, but it had no effect on the sun. They concluded that the sun station could never cause the sun to go supernova. After the failure of the sun station, the Nomai took a break to investigate the newly arrived comet. According to a Nomai computer, our sun has reached the end of its natural life cycle. Huh. You know, I wonder if... Uh, I hoped I was wrong about that. But I wonder if the Nomai have ever heard of star lifting. If I remember correctly, it can extend the life of a star by making it a bit more efficient. Speaking of the interloper, I've been meaning to go there. Now that means another trip to Amber Twin, but this time we're just going to the gravity cannon. After the gravity cannon, we're going to um, recall the saddle, um, the um, the shuttle from the gravity cannon. Hang on a minute. Okay, so the gravity cannon... I think I ought to mark it here first. There we go. I keep forgetting to do this sort of thing. So it's a hundred and something meters that way. I'm going to have to um, jump the gulf. But I am capable of doing that, especially on a planet with gravity this low. Um, there we go, much better. See, I think this must be a natural path to the gravity cannon's control station. Um, or not. So I'll just have to jump in. Oh, come on. So, the shuttle is currently resting at the comets going to call it home like that. And then... Especially now that Ash has passed... I'm going to see if I can get out of here. Um, There we go. And our next destination is the interloper. Alright, so I gotta be able to find the interloper first, and I don't have as much time with it as I as I do in general. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's 
thing I want to do now is blast off while this, um, another plant's overhead, otherwise I'll slam right into it. I think it's gone now. Let me see if I can find the interloper. I know it's around here someplace. What's that? Is that it over there? That's too far away. Um, uh, there it is. The only problem with landing on this thing is that it's not exactly... I, its orbit is a little... Um, it, it's not in the same plane, you know? What the... Blow me right down. I'm sure it was right. You know, about the, um, about stars going supernova. They do all seem to be doing so at the same time, but... I am not sure why. Oh, good grief. Am I gonna... Okay. Now this comet is like mostly mostly ice and rock, like any comet. So theoretically, like anything. Okay, if there's one thing I don't want to do, it's use my jetpack and. I guess jump. Because if I did that, then. then it's possible that I might. Um... I might leave the comet. and not be able to get back. I'm just having a look at at the poles. Oh my goodness, is that the white hole? Yeah. We certainly are having a nice tour to solar system here, aren't we? Doesn't seem to be anything at the poles. But I did land my ship, I think, at the uh, quote unquote front of the comet. Oh, it's a snowflake. Oh, that's weird. Okay, what does this comet have to offer here? Oh, 
Oh, there's all lots. There's lots of crevices. I wonder if I can follow them anywhere. I'm not exactly sure how much ice has boiled off just yet. Nor am I sure where that ship is, or was. Tail of the comet right now. So that's the tail. I better get back to the ship, refuel my oxygen. Not expecting that. So the inside of this thing is hollow. Wait a second, is this before it crashes into the sun or no? There's ghost matter in here. There's ghost matter in here. There's a tree in here. Just see if I was getting worried there for a minute. I'm receiving much stronger energy readings now that we're beneath the crust. Whatever it is must lie somewhere closer to the comet center, and I'm starting to think it's much more dangerous than we realized. Clara, can you hear us? Yes, but your voices are faint. I fear we'll lose communication entirely if we continue any deeper. Keep the shuttle warm for us, Clary. We'll return the moment we identify the source of the energy readings. I understand, but be cautious, both of you. Okay, so there's ghost matter at the end of that tunnel. be at the end of all of these. Except that one. Okay, it looks like this is the tunnel we ought to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ooh boy. Super happy fun slide, ladies and gentlemen. Super happy whoa, boy. Hang on a second. Is that ghost matter? Is that not ghost matter? Where is there ghost matter? No. No. Wait a tick. So there, this is a hole. And it's a hole full of ghost matter. Hang on a minute. That is a lot of the stuff. I could kill on contact.
but here. Higher. Just a bit. Okay, well, let me see if I can actually stick this landing here. Ah, landing well stuck. So where does this go? Oh my goodness, wait a second. Okay, what about over here? Ouch. I get the distinct impression that if I were to um, I know maybe the expression all roads lead to Rome well here they all lead to ghost matter makes me wonder how I'm gonna get out of here I suppose I could go back the way I came Was that exactly? Maybe it was here. Wait a second, what was that? I'm the only one that saw that green egg thing. Alright, well. Okay, that area is dangerous too. Hmm. You know, I can't help but think that if I were to take the same route that, that my scout did, I might pass close to ghost matter, but I won't actually hit it. It's a risk. Well, which way? So this is predicated off the idea that my Wait, wait a minute. Where am I going? Over the hole. Okay, that's the one advantage I got over the scout. Oh, and there's a dead Nomai here. And this... Disappointing. Where's it go? Is it my imagination, or did that place with all the big crystals not contain any ghost matter? Wait a minute. Hello? Right down. The spherical stone casing here seems to be the source of the energy readings. No, rather the source is what's within the stone. I'm detecting some form of exotic matter. The stone is muting our energy readings. They should be ten times what we're seeing at least. Oh, come on, don't do this.
I don't think we want this matter interacting with us. As far as I can tell, direct contact with it would almost certainly be fatal. I've never encountered anything like this in casing, but it's all that's protecting us from what's inside. We're, we're still, this matter is disturbingly volatile. Whatever the matter is inside the stone casing, it's more than just profoundly unstable. It's under tons of pressure. Look at this density scan. I've never seen anything this tightly compacted before. What is this? This is orders of magnitude worse than I'd imagined. If the stone were to rupture, the lethal matter within would rapidly expand, completely blanketing the star system almost instantaneously, and the pressure is still building as the comet approaches the star system. Return to the shuttle right now. The rest of our friends need to know they're in ter terrible danger. Leave your equipment and run. What are you doing, Pi? The more we know about this alien matter, the better our chances of survival. I will learn what I can here. Go, warn the others. Maybe they can construct shelter somehow. Now, Poke. I think I'm starting to understand something around here. This is where all the ghost matter in this system came from. So, how exactly do I get out? Not that way. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'll just suffocate to death in here. Is that the way I just scratched off? Yeah, it is. Alright. What the... 